another video and today's video is is a conspiracy theory so before we get started um i'll make a few announcements the first announcement is i'm gonna be doing a collab with the amazing fanny and and that's gonna be next this week around this week but but we don't know when so and then my second announcement is that I'm going to be singing another song that I wrote um, probably today or tomorrow or on Monday because I'm on vacation. So today's conspiracy theory, theory will be about Dora the Explorer. So let's go! The first theory I'm going to be talking about is that Dora is the devil. So, um, there's, there's been this rumor, like, around YouTube, like, if you search up Dora the Explorer, um, backwards, it actually says Hell Satan, so, and other people say that she's connected to Illuminati, <laughs> and, and I think that's basically all, is it? I think. But yeah, it said, yeah, in most of my research, it says that, Do that Dora is, is actually the devil, so, and I don't know if you guys used to, I don't know if I told you guys this, but I used to like Dora when I was like a little girl, like my entire room, I had like strips of Dora and I would like put it around here. And it'll be like, yeah, and I love Dora, and I also have some vi videos of Dora, and yeah. So, the, th the theories, uh, um, before I go to the next theory, um, these theories are from fan theories on the website here that you can't really see, but yeah. So... The theory is Dora is actually a computer game. So, um, I know, like, in the first two seasons, um, it shows, like, the camera going into, like, a computer room. And, like, if you see, there's, like, because if, if most of you guys saw Dora, then, um, it will say the blue arrow and, like, it will, like, follow her anywhere. So, yeah, so Dora is actually a computer game, and I'm actually going to read from here, because sometimes I don't remember my research, and the real life Dory. <laughs> um, where it says, yeah, so it says right here, firstly, in the intro of season one and two, there's a scene that shows the camera moving through the empty room into a computer screen. That's because... Um, everyone has long died and Dora wants a video game character game sentence along with the other char other characters. So, yeah. And, oh. The cursor. Whenever Dora asks the audience to find an object, a blue arrow points to the object, lights up, and makes a sh short sound similar to how real life mouse cursor wor works. So, and comment down if you, if you believe any of these are true, so, yeah, um, so, um, um, oh, yes, I can't, but, yeah, that's basically, that's basically the theory, so, yeah. Hmm. Theory is that Dora has dementia or or schizophrenia. If you guys don't know what schizophrenia is, I don't even know how to say it. But it says a disorder that affects a a person's ability to think, feel, and how they behave. So in this, so in this theory, um, I've noticed that Dora. Okay, I'm going to have it right here, so just in case. So. 
I'm I'm new to this conspiracy theory thing, so don't mock me. But I'll get better in the earlier future. So it basically says here that um um that boots her psychic monkey um at talks like a human being like all of us um it said that um boots is actually her um psychic and mostly since monkeys cannot talk um it's like one of Dora's imaginations and that it's only her but yeah mm. And as we all know, um, Dora, Dora explores around the world, so she's always wandering around the world. And but she's actually, but I don't even. But it says here that that like in one of the episodes, I don't think I saw it, but it was one of the episodes. Where she said that she, she was in Africa and she said that she, that she can see her American, her American, I'm stupid, think better, that she could see her Mexican home. Since, because as we all know in reality, Africa is so far away, so this could be another one, yes, it could be another one of her delusions. And, yeah, and there's, like, so many theories about this, but, yeah, that's the theory. So, hmm, on to the next one. The theory is pretty messed up, and it says that Dora's parents are dead and are involved in a cartel. But, yeah, since Dora basically lives with her grandma, um... Uh, oh yeah. Um, since when we see when we when little kids see Dora, I mean, they don't really see her parents because she's always with her grandma. So according to this theory, it says that her parents were drug addicts and they put Dora out for death. So um, and it also said that. And they also said that, um, hold on, let me look for it. Oh, see, I said I got conspiracy theories, but I'm learning, so. Ah, oh, okay. So, basically, Dor Dora's parents left her for dead on the streets. And so, basically, she, she escaped the cartel. And has been on the run and has been traveling around the world with her sidekick boots. And um, this one involves a mental illness that she has, but I will explain that in the last theory after this. But so it basically says that because um, you, <clears throat> you know how, like, her she has her backpack and and there's this middle map sticking out in one of the pockets so basically um she can't even read maps because even when her little map pal um says says it three times where to go um she still can't remember because of her illness but yeah this pretty messed up, so <laughs> I'm just reading off the internet. But I'll get, but I'll get the used to it. So <laughs> next theory, next theory is that Dora has Down syndrome. So basically, um, Down syndrome is a mental disability that suffers from ADHD. So that's why she can't remember when Map tells her three times. And it actually says that Boots is actually her guiding animal and helps Dora. And it also says 
that on Dora's wrist, like you can see like a bracelet that I can't remem even remember because <laughs> it's been so long and I hate Dora so but yeah um since Dora had like this yellow bracelet around her wrist it possibly says that it's a check device that will that basic that is a checking device so like if she gets lost, um, it would mean a finding her, but um, yeah, and basically that's all of the theories I have for today, but yeah, these are, I don't really believe one of, I don't really believe any of these, but as I said, um, these are just fan theories from the website, so comment down which ones you think are... <laughs> Comment down which ones you think are real. I don't think any of these are real. Um, cause it's pretty messed up. Even, even on the one that says her parents are dead. So, um, the only two ones that I, that I really do believe is that she's actually a computer gram game <laughs> language. That she's actually a a computer game. And she's actually the devil. So those are the only two I believe. Um, and yeah, schizophrenia. Um, I don't think she has that. But. Because um, there are people that have schizophrenia. <laughs> can't even say it right. But. But. Um, there are people that have schizophrenia. And. I don't want to insult them. So. Um, I think it's. Um, I think that, I think it's messed up that the curators of Dora the Explorer would put, like, a deep meaning into her, and I'm, and yeah, so we comment down which one you think, and, um, there's this thing around the internet that says, um, um, like how people on Instagram are saying Instagrammer of the week and all of that. So I'm, and there are other YouTubers that has do it too. So I'm going to be making my own and these are my own. So this is, so this is the jewels of the week or jewelry or I know, but jewels. But yeah, to become jewels of the week, all you have to do is like, subscribe and comment on my video. So on my videos. <laughs> so yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys so much. And stay tuned for the collab with Fanny.